we had a very, uh, I think, exciting year in 2014. One of the highlights for me was uh, a project that we did using the technique of photogrammetry. Photogrammetry just refers to measuring from photographs. And in this case, we were using a, a little unmanned helicopter to take uh, photographs of killer whales from directly overhead in the wild up in uh, Johnson Strait. And from those photos, we could tell the body condition of the whales. This, that was the, the purpose. We could tell how fat they were. And as it turned out, uh, identify and recognize pregnant females very easily. Animals that were in particularly poor condition um, stood out. And I think it's going to be a very valuable technique that we use in the future. Killer whales are very much in the news this year with, with, with a couple of high profile deaths of southern resident killer whales, a birth. Um, we had uh, a young northern resident killer whale entangled in nets up on the central BC coast. Um, I think they reinforced how much the public really in British Columbia and in Canada generally care about the species. It's, it's so iconic. I think there's also a growing awareness in the BC public at least about how critically endangered one of our populations of killer whales are. We know a lot about that population and, and the Vancouver Aquarium can claim a lot of credit for that. I, I love the fact that, we, that we're making a difference, you know, that our research gets rapidly communicated to the public. Um, we're an authority that often get approached by the media to uh, ask questions. It gives us an opportunity to talk about the challenges that marine mammals face and what can be, can be done about them. And again, I think we're well positioned to carry that message uh, forward.